What is going on guys, it's Waffle here and welcome back to some more bug snacks. Now last time we left off, we just started doing Shelda's side quests as well as we did Wiggles like boss battle thing, legendary battle thing. <laughs> Still doing the weird frame rate thing, and that, yeah, now she looks like a weird, like, sushi roll thing for her body, Hi. which is awesome. Let's talk to you, let's eat, uh, what she have to say if I just say, let's chat? Shelda is delightful, darling. The way she speaks is captivating, even if I haven't the faintest idea what she's saying. Yeah, I don't know if she even has the idea of what she's saying either. Catch you on the flip side. All right, well, let's go, speaking of Shelda, let's go, just, let's go talk to... In the world, she said that twice in a row. <laughs> Let's go talk to Shelda. Oh, yeah, yeah, We still have to get the inch wrap for her, the cheeser, the green peel bug. Now, where was the green peel bug? Because I know where to get the inch wrap and the cheeser. Those are relatively easy. Oh, Scorched Gorge. Okay. Yeah, it's the one that we have to get with the buggy ball. Okay, that, that's easy. So we should be able to get the, uh, we don't have an inchworm right now. We don't have a cheeser right now. Okay, well, I guess we can go get a, yum. <laughs> I guess we can go get those real quick. And then also what I want to do is, because I got so many comments from you guys saying, you know, because we did the Mama Melon mission, we did the, the Masa Supreme mission, you know, for the legendaries, and then we just did the Mega Maki mission, uh, legendary for that, last episode. There is one more legendary that we have yet to do. Is it here? No, it's, it's in the next one. Yeah, 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 the lettuce wrap guy. Uh, there's one more mission that we have yet to do. And apparently we have to do, we have to talk to Snorpy about that, so let's go talk to him, see if there's, I, I, I don't know if we fin, I guess we'll look at the book and see if we actually finish his quest lines or whatever, uh, uh, to actually do the legendary. Let's see, where's Snorpy at? Oh, I guess I can't do it yet? Light all the flares. Uh, I, I guess we just have to keep an eye on Snorpy. And see if it like pops up later. Oh yeah, and then yeah, I've got to do the Befiga one too. Yeah, yeah. Well, let's just go over here. Let's go grab the lettuce wrap. That should be relatively easy, right? Just lure it into like a rock or whatever like that, and then uh, we should be able to just get it. And then also while we're here in Flavor Falls, is there uh, somewhere we could sleep? I don't know if there is, because I want to turn it to like daytime and nighttime and stuff like that over and over again, and see if it'll like rain. Because there's one creature here. We have yet to get, and it only comes out whenever it's raining. We saw that last episode. Oh yeah, and I got some comments from you guys saying that it should be like in this cave, I think, and that we actually saw like the 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 what was it called? That? Yeah, the caramel goop. The sticky glob is evidence of a bug snack. It appears uh, when it rains. Yep, that's the one. So yeah. Oh my gosh, it's everywhere. So whenever it does rain, we need to come back inside of here. And hopefully that caramel goop creature will be out and we can actually scan it and hopefully catch it as well. So that's going to be good. Well, let's speaking of catching creatures, let's go up here and see if we can catch that uh, inch wrap. A little lettuce wrap guy up here. Should be relatively easy. Let's get the, uh, whoops. Let's get, uh, not that. Not that. The trip shot. That should be good. At least like right here, I suppose. And aim. Uh, maybe a little bit lower up there. Oh, wait. Yeah, how do we get it out of the ground? Oh, wait, hold on, hold on. Here we go, here we go. See if we can lure it into it. What, what is it like again? It loves ranch and cheese. Okay, well, let's get the, uh, that. Let's see. Unfortunately, I still have to pull up this thing. Let's get the, uh, oh, whoops, what? It just grabbed it right there. Oh, no, there's the centipede. Ooh. Yeah, we don't want the si Oh, hold on, hold on. Let's do that. Can I get it while it's burrowed? Oh, I can't get it while it's burrowed. Man. All right, hold on, hold on. Let's get the, uh, cheese. Aim it at the thing. There we go. It's covered in cheese. Perfect. Oh, no, I fell off. No. Oh, I think I activated it. Oh, yes, yes, I think we got it. Oh, my God, it's full. Wait, no, I got it. Wait, what is that? It's a lol. What is it? I don't know what it is. Did the lolif catch a lolif? What? That's a thing. <laughs> I didn't think that you could catch yourself, but the lolif caught a lolif there. I guess, yeah, the lolif does like cheese as well. So maybe we should use a ranch or something like that to catch the, uh, the entrap over here. That sounds, that was funny. Let's get the, uh... So we need to, we need to make him, like, crash into a rock first so we can actually make him come out of the ground, you know? So let's see. Let's aim there. Then we need to aim ranch. Aim it, like, right there. That should be good. He comes out of the ground. There we go, he's out of the ground. He's gonna hit the trap. Oh, yes, he hit the trap! Perfect! He didn't even activate the trap. Boom, we got the entrap! And then, and then we got the centipedes! 
Oh, <laughs> uh, you know what? We'll keep the sand of PT. Yeah, you guys can stay here. Unfortunately, I don't think there's anywhere I could sleep. It's sort of like daytime, or, uh, you know, nighttime, daytime. And just kind of go all over the place and see if it'll start raining. So I guess we'll just go back and go to Scorch Gorge next, as well as the Sizzling Sands. Because we need to get the green peel bug, and we need to get the cheesers. So let's head over there real quick. And then we'll finish off Shelda's quests over here, where... She supposedly <laughs> sets these guys free or releases the toxins or whatever she says, but she's actually just eating them, as we saw by her her hand or something like that being a, uh, or her leg. Yeah, her foot. Oh, wait. Oh, wait, look at that! She didn't request the, uh, the sushi, but her other foot turned into the sushi, the mini maki. So if I feed, if I, I could actually just feed her anything right now. Let me just, okay, let's put the entrap over there. Boom. Uh, what if we did a wee melon? There you go. Oh, and I did get some comments from you guys. I guess we could test this out while we're over in the Sizzling Sands area. Look at look at Chandlow. He looks amazing. <laughs> but while we're in Sizzling Sands, apparently you guys were saying, yeah, the little minions, like the me uh, mini, what was it called? Wee Melon and the Bombinos and the Mini Maki, those were all just like respawn. So I guess they're not like a limited amount. So I don't need to be too careful about them being in my inventory and stuff like that. So that's good. But, uh, oh, wait. Did I already pass it? Oh, I did. Ooh, okay. So, I... Ah, I forgot what these guys like. Probably chocolate, because I think that's what was on the beach. Whenever we learned about the whole buggy ball meme, right? So, there you go. We lure you into there. Little shrabby. And then over here. Here it is right here. Here's the end. Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, my, my trap is, like, sideways, but I think it might, it might still work. If the green peel bug comes out. Oh, is it... Oh my god, there it is. Ow! No! Get Oh, I got it right there. Holy egg! Hell bug. A pill bug. <laughs> we got it right there. Nice. It was like going in and out and stuff like that. And then, of course, the spuddy kept on running into it and turning it sideways and stuff. But let's head on over to Sizzling Sands now and let's go get the cheeser. That one's going to be relatively easy. Just sit down the trip shot, wait for it to come around. I think it goes around the whole entire area. And then, of course, it'll just run into the trip shot and we can get it no problemo. So, uh, let's get the trip shot. I keep forgetting which numbers I need. Oh, there's the cheese right there. Hold on. Oh, but it's so fast, though. I don't think I'm able to... Oh, wait. No, it, j it just randomly ran into something right there. Okay. <laughs> Hold on. Oh. There you go. And... Oh, my gosh. I got him instantly. That was amazing. Holy. Oh, uh... I also got comments from you guys saying something in Boiling Bay. We need to go back to... Bo Man, there's so much we need to do, you guys. <laughs> we need to go back to Boiling Bay and try and catch more and more, uh creatures over there we have yet to catch sugarpine woods is yeah we have to get the full-on bobsicle the big bobsicle frosted peak yeah there's still seven creatures we have yet to catch we'll worry about that a little bit later perhaps whenever we do the uh egg bell stuff 12 out of 12 on scorch gorge 12 out of 15 on boiling bay so the purple uh grape skeeto the green crapple that's two the fire uh cheap poof that's three and that should take us to 15 so that's good yeah so once we're in boiling bay you guys said there was a puzzle that we have to do, and it's like in the volcano, so we're gonna have to go look at that and figure that out. And then uh, Simmering Springs, 12 out of 12 there. Flavor Falls, 12 out of 13. That's gonna be the uh, caramel thing whenever it rains, so we're gonna get all that. We're actually like really close to getting all the bug snacks, you guys. That is crazy. But for right now, let's just go back to uh, Shelda, go give her the cheeser and green peel bug, and then <laughs> probably by the time we go back there right now, her one of her arms or something like that is gonna be like a, a wee melon. <laughs> Because we just donated a wee melon to her, so I wouldn't be too surprised if she has like a wee melon like foot or uh oh I think both of our feet are uh, bug snacks right now. Probably like a leg or an arm or something like that. <laughs> Let's go see what she's up to. See if she's released the toxins into her body. <laughs> Alright, let's go to Shelda. Oh wait, where is she? She's gone. Okay, well let's give her the uh cheeser. Green peel bug. Boom! Return to Shelda. Yeah, I don't know where she is. Probably uh Oh, there she is right there. Okay. Let's go talk to her. Another fine day behind us. Look at that! Look at that! She ate the entrap. She ate the wee melon. It's only been like a couple minutes. You've already eaten them. What are you doing, Shelda? I made more offerings to the box. Oh, great! Ahem. <clears throat> One is pleased. Another step taken along the path. Return one day hence. Uh, again. Ah, nothing like getting toasty. Yeah, I know. Why don't you walk in and inspire and get toasty just like I did a couple times? <laughs> yeah, seems like we need to go back to Shelda 
after a, a whole day, so I might as well do that. And then... Oh, yeah. I wonder, does it rain here? Oh, what in the world's Krondo yeah, doing? Hi. What are you doing up here? He's just all... Is he going to steal from me or something like that? What are you doing? Listen up, pal. I got a nose for phonies. Befica? <laughs> Wiggle? Eh, fat. And don't even get me started on Shelda. She makes me look like an honest grumpus. Yeah, I know. She says she's going to release the, the bug sacks, and then she releases them from the box and into her mouth. What up with that? <laughs> Anyways, goodbye. Bye 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 All right, well, I might as well go to bed. But yeah, I, I don't know if it actually rains here. I don't know if... Time's it right now? 6 p.m.? Okay, what about, like, noon or something like that? If it rains here, it's probably going to be raining in Flavor Falls. Oh, it's not raining. What if I did, like, 5 p.m.? I'm just going to do this over and over until it, like, looks like it's raining. And then we'll go to Flavor Falls and try and catch whatever. Uh, let's do midnight now. Nope, it's still clear skies and everything. Uh, 5 a.m. again. I don't know. Like, I feel like it might just be exclusive to Flavor Falls, which is weird to say. Like, it only rains there or something. But that's, like, kind of rare. I don't know if there's, like, a way I could actually, like, make it rain. Other than just, like, doing this over and over. But we should be able to talk to Shelda again by now, right? Where is she over here? Oh! Jeez. Oh, <laughs> did she eat more? Oh, yep, she's got a cheese her leg! And everyone's, like, gathered around her, and she's got, like, a, a, a lime-sliced leg down there as well. <laughs> We are ready to receive your wisdom, O oh Great Shelda. One who stands atop the mountain cannot see beneath the waves. So it is one must dive to see the mountain top clearly. Wait a minute, you got bug snacks in you. No, I don't. <laughs> Darling, it's clear as day. Good for you. Change things up a little. Uh, um, uh, the toxin is spreading through the very air. One is tainted by your miasma of snacks. Leave now so that one may be purified. I don't think that's how it works. Chill, bro. It's a metaphor. Yes, that. Walk in the light of the mother, my children. What in the world was that camera angle? Oh, I think the camera got stuck on the box. <laughs> That's why I didn't move uh, to like where it should have gone. Shelda, what happened to your whole body? Having trouble? Oh, one is not so easily led astray. So it is. The greatest temptation begets the greatest faith. Sprinkle peed. Palatos and Flapjackarack. These heinous toxins must be brought to the box. Man, she's got a sweet tooth. Are you sure? Cut the act. Yeah, just cut the act already. Like I, I know you're, you're, you're trying to, just, you're just trying to fool me into bringing you bug snacks, which is you are. <laughs> I am still bringing you bug snacks, but just cut the act already. One who is me is certain. Yada yada yada. Just get the grumping snacks already. <laughs> All right. Uh. Oh, what was it? Oh, yeah. Sprinkle peed, Palatos, Flapjack Rack. We, we need to go to the Boiling Bay anyways to get the, uh, to get the something else. I forgot what it was. Uh, but we have to get the Palatos over there. And then Sprinkle peed, we need to go to the forest over there. And Flapjack Rack is back at the Sizzling Sands. Okay, well, let's go over to this beach over here. What was this called? Simmering Springs? Let's go over here. We need to get, like, two more grump, grumpy snack pods for, uh, Bevica. Kind of want to go see what she wants those for. I've, it's been so long, I already forgot about it. Uh, oh. Oh, yeah, yeah, see, look at that. That one respawned as well. So, yeah, they do respawn. Uh, whoops, that's the wrong thing. They do respawn, so just... Snack pod. Snack pod. So just, I guess, wait. Oh, and there's an... There you go, instantly. Easy. There's the other one right there. Snack pod. Snack pod. We are, uh, we're already over here. We might as well go over to the Boiling Bay and see if we can actually catch the Palatos. And, oh, yeah, while we're in the... Sugar Pine Woods or whatever, we need to get the, uh, the big bobsicle too, so we need to get that and the sprinkle peat over there. There's a lot we need to do over here, you guys. We need to catch so many bug snacks. Oh, 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 low frame rate. Boiling Bay time, you guys. All right, so we need to get the Palatos. Now, what... It says Palat... Is it... Which one's... Oh, gosh. <laughs> Weird for a low frame rate there, too. Which one's the Palatos? Is it Big Palatos? That's the... 
Yeah, Paletas Grande. So she just wants a little, little one right there. Okay, so let's get that one. And that should be relatively easy. Just split it up. And we do know now we can actually get the... This thing. And basically have control over... Like, oh, wait, hold on. Oh, yeah, you can only shoot it in specific areas. There you go. That should be good. Oh, wait. Oh! Oh, there we go. Oh, my God. Oh, you can basically just shoot it at. Oh, my God. He's about to explode. He's going to blow. Oh, eight seconds. Eight seconds. Keep going. It's there it goes. Keep going. Oh! You hit... Oh, he hit the coconut right there, too. <laughs> okay, that's good. Okay, five more seconds. Oh, wait. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, that's if I wanted to get the big Palita or the Palitas Grande. Hold on. Is he going to explode yet or what? Oh! Oh, he still exploded. Okay, that's good. Let me get you, boom. Okay, now what is the crapple like? He loves chocolate and peanut butter. Okay, let, let's let's get the let's get a crapple. Uh, ooh, whoops. Hold on. Uh, retrieve that. We need to get the crapple, and then we need to get the flaming hot chi poof. Oh yeah, and then there's the puzzle over there you guys told me about too. So, what in the world? There you go. Okay, that worked. Uh, cover this thing in chocolate, and that should be. Oh, whoops. What in the world? Oh, okay, it covered it right there. So that's good. Uh, I guess just wait for the crapple. And then, oh, there's the, uh, the Grape Skeeto. Ooh. There we go. Get the chocolate right there. We need to get the Grape Skeeto as well. Where is the... Where did the Crapple go? Oh, th I think there he is all the way over there. Yeah, he's all the way over there. Okay, we have to wait a little while for that. Uh, but I do want to get the... Oh, yeah, yeah, The, uh... Let's get the Buggy Ball. And then let's cover it in chocolate, too. There you go. And we'll bring the, uh, Golden Queeble. Oh, no, it's on fire. What? <laughs> My Buggy Ball's on fire! Come here, come here, come here. Come on, little Queeble. No, the Queeble's on fire. No. Oh, no, it activated my trap. Man, you Queeble. Oh. Man, I don't know. Oh, no. Oh, no, the Crapple's going to get him. The Crapple got him. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I just wanted to bring him up. Hold on. What about, like, a Binopper or something like that? Well, those things are only in the sky for so long. Oh. Oh, I forget that the Sodi thing does that. Yeah, we're at, uh, hold on, hold on. There's the crap Crapple right there. Hold on. Aim. Hit it with, uh, chocolate. Oh, no, it's on fire, too. Man! Hold on. Uh, get that. Retract. Oh, the whole thing's still on fire, though. Whoops. Hold on. What if I shoot it into water, though? Like, if I shoot it... What if I shoot it, uh... Uh, there. Is that gonna, like, extinguish the fire? No! Oh, wait. Yeah, it did. Yeah, look at that. The, the, the water's spreading over here, too. That's cool. Literal... <laughs> I think we walk in. <laughs> I'm sorry, little guy. Oh. All right. Well, let's just wait for the green drop. Oh. Uh, I need to aim this just right. There you go. Let's wait for the green crapple to come back over here. There you go. Okay, we got him right there. Okay, that's good. Whew. Uh, but the Queeble's probably going to hit it again, to be quite honest. Let's just, oh, no, I'm on fire. Go in the water. Go in the water. There you go. Whew. All right. Hopefully, the Queeble, you better stay away. No. Queeble. Uh, there you go. Stay away. There you go. All right, hopefully the, uh, crapple... Oh, I can't really lure him to... Oh, there you go. There you go. Oh, nice. He's going to the, into the... What? What? He just grabs the trip shot? You kidding me? Oh, did I catch him right there? Oh, I did. Wait, no. Wait, what? Oh, oh, I did. I was about to say, did he just, like, cease to exist? He just... <laughs> I, guess, I guess he can still catch the crapple. Whatever, he's, like, yeah, picking up something. I didn't even think he was able to pick up a trip shot. That was crazy. Now, is there any other way I can get the Grape Skeeto to eat something? Either that or, uh... How would I? Let me scan it again. Oh, whoops, that's the fruity goo. Uh, there it is. Uh, seems more solitary. I don't know. There's like nothing, unless uh, maybe the, uh, how do I bring this guy over here? He doesn't like, like any, yeah, he doesn't like any type of sauce. He doesn't like fire. Ooh! Oh, well, he doesn't like fire because he'll extinguish it with his, uh, his water. But if I, if I lure, if I bring the buggy ball over here. I don't think I can lure the Sodi like out of water. Like, we oh wait, oh oh yeah, I can, yeah I can. Look at that. Hold on, no. Hold on. Now, what does the grape Skeeto like again? Chocolate, I think. If I cover, if I cover you in chocolate, can he like spray himself? I don't think so. Hold on, buggy ball. What if I cover this in chocolate again? There you go. Where's the grape Skeeto at? There. Oh oh, the grape Skeeto. Go get him. Grape Skeeto's drinking the La Sodi. There we go. We got him. I didn't think that would work, but it did. Grapeskeedo. Uh, let me check the book. Let's see. Boiling Bay. 
14 out of Okay, so yeah, the only thing we're missing is the chi poof. So, let's get our buggy ball back. There you go. Yeah, but how will we get the... The flaming hot guy then? I never even scanned it, did I? Yeah, flaming chi poof. Much like the chi poofs of the desert, except that they're constantly on fire. Floofty says, constantly on fire, you say. That gives me an idea. <laughs> Whoops. Well, they're going in like a, uh... Figure eight pattern. Unless... Ooh! Is this guy still... He is. Ooh, hold on. Oh, wait, hold on. Can he... If, if I make him ram into a trip shot, does that make the trip shot, like, cold, and I can transfer the... And I can maybe, like, trap... Or hit the, uh, the flame and chi poof? Oh, no, wait. Oh, it, maybe it did? Did it work right there? What did he just hit right there? Oh, my God, my thing's like... Oh, wait, oh, my God, it's, like, glitched. It's under the ground. What? How did that even happen? I have no idea. Let me retrieve that. That didn't work at all. <laughs> Jeez. There's another snack pot over there. Holy tots. Oh, no. No, he split. Now, what happens if I don't catch him? Are they going to go right back together? I never really looked at it. Like, the counter's about to go, and then... Okay, they could just go back to freezing, I guess, and they're just small little versions of it. Okay. Oh, no! Man! Oh! What in the world? Oh, I'm... Oh, I'm... There you go. I'm still frozen, that's why. Hold on. Now, how do I get the, uh... These guys, though? So, if, if I... If I throw the, uh... Hold on. Let me hit this guy. Ah! There you go. Whew. All right. Nice. But if I throw the snack trap at him... Oh, there's the, uh... The thing you guys were talking about. The, these little statues. With a little cocoa, whatever it's called. Ooh. I don't know what that was about. Oh, jeez. Thought something was happening back there. Uh, I think I already messed something up over here. Yeah, I'll figure that out a little bit later, but... I need to figure... Oh, is there something behind... No, there's nothing behind this waterfall. There's a grumpy... St or uh, another, uh, like a... I forgot what it was called. Fruity snack pot, I think. How would I get these guys down, though? Like, if I hit them with the trap, uh, the, the lunch pad... And the snack trap, like, it's just going to go on fire, right? Uh-oh. Whoa, whoa, why are those guys attracted to the trap? Uh-oh. Wait, lunch party? I just randomly got... I guess I because I launched two creatures with a snack... Snack thing, whatever, lunch pad. How would I get these guys to get... Like, I can't get them with a the snack grappler, obviously, because they're not... They're not stunned. They're still just flying around normally. How would I... How do I attract them? Oh, no, I'm on fire! I'm, no, wait, no. Now I'm on fire. <laughs> I was frozen. Now I'm on fire. Oh, there you go. Okay, I'm back to normal. That's good. Whew. All right, let's go over here. Hopefully, I'm good. Hold on. Let me let me scan these guys. Uh, journal entry. Do they like anything? They don't. And the only way you catch chi poofs is by launching the lunch pad with the snack trap. But these these guys are on fire, so unless I hold on, can I get the lunch pad to aim at them, like that one specifically? And then I, I get the Politos guy to ram into the lunch the this, and then hopefully it freezes it. So it's a frozen thing, maybe? Hold on, hold on. Over here, over here, over here. They hit it? Oh, well, they did, but it kind of, like, exploded. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, I don't know how to get these guys. I don't know. I'll have to come back here a little bit later. It seems like a tricky one, you guys. Uh, oh, did we get the Politos? Yeah, we got the Politos. Why does it say I still have to add the Politos? I have a Politos right now. Like, oh, does does she want the Politos Grande? Uh, offer sprinkle. Pe okay, so I think that just means I have to put it in the box itself. Oh yeah, well, let's try and figure out this this puzzle over here though. These guys all have to be. Ooh, hold on. Oh wait, no, the 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 clue I'm thinking about only. Yeah, first left, and then yeah, three. This one's four. Huh. I don't know. Oh, what was this one? Yeah, we already saw that projector tape. I wonder if we have all the clues by now. Probably, because we already interviewed everyone, you know? Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Hold on. I'm looking at all these guys right now. They have different amount of, like, straw tusks. Like, this one has two. This one has four. That one has three and, and one. If I do it in order, is that how you do it? One, two, three, four. Two. That should be a pretty simple puzzle. If this isn't it, we have to do it in the other way. Four, three, two, one. Or... What? Is that not what? Oh, you probably have to do it a certain, uh, hold on. Can I just do this? No. Thought I had to do it, like, really fast. I guess not. Hold on. One. Two. Three. And then let's do four before it, like, times out. Oh! Does that work? Oh, my God! It worked! That reminds me of a puzzle achievement right there. Nice! All right! Thank you guys very much for letting me know about that thing. What does this go to? 
Ooh. Oh, it's a shortcut to Sizzling Sands. Oh, that is perfect. We need to go over here for, anyways for the Flapjack Rack. That's good. Is there anything else we need to do over here? Oh yeah, we still have to get the sprint. Wait, what in the world? Where does this go out to though? Uh, oh. Wait, this was here this whole time? And I didn't even see it? <laughs> I guess so. What time is it? 5 a.m.? Yeah, the, uh, the Flapjack Rack should be around right now at this time. It's probably just circling around because he goes- Oh, yep, there he is right there. Hold on. How do I get him again? Uh, I think just hit him with a trip shot, just basically, and that should get him, right? So let's place it down, like, right there. Boom. Aim it at the tree. Oh, that's probably not good enough. Hold on. Do that. And then I think chocolate or something like that, right? Chocolate or peanut butter, one of those. Uh, either of them. Okay, so that's good. So, uh, let me get the buggy ball covered in chocolate or peanut butter. Uh, let's do peanut butter because I'm getting a little bit lower on chocolate. Let's try and lure him into the thing. And I don't know if that's too high up on him. Like, he's really, he's really, like, low to the ground. So he might, he might not even, even... Oh, activate. Yeah. Oh, 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 he's going, he's going to go into the thing. Oh, there we go. Perfect. We got him. Flap jack rack Flap jack a rack Flap jack a rack <laughs> There you go, alright. Is there anything here we missed out on? I think we got everything, but I just want to make sure while we're here. Summoning Springs, Boiling Bay, Scorched Gorge, Sizzling Sands. 15 out of 15, perfect! Alright, nice, you guys, awesome. Oh yeah, another thing was, you guys were saying that the, uh, the Bombinos, like, respawned over here. Are they still over here? I do see what looks like two or three things up there on fire. I don't know if these are the same- oh, there's an egg right there, I could've used that egg, too. Yeah, there's like three of them up here still, so that's good. I don't know if these are the same ones that were here previously. Oh, there's a, another snack pod right there, like a nutty snack or a meaty snack pod. But I don't know if these are the same ones that were here uh, previously when we did the... Oh, the little symbol's gone now, so I can't even do the giant pizza slicer thing. <laughs> when if we did the uh, Monster Supreme uh, boss battle slash legendary thing. So I don't know if those are the same ones or if those respawned or whatever, because we got a lot of them. We had like... I don't know, like six of them or something like that, if I had to guess. Like those little Totino's pizza roll things. <laughs> but let's head back to Scorch Gorge now. I wonder if there's any more instances where there's like a, a shortcut like that. Where you can go from... Scorpino. Where you can go from... Let's see. Because we went from Boiling Bay to Sizzling Sands. Is there a way from Sizzling Sands to Sugar Pine Woods, maybe? That would save us some time, honestly. What's this little paw on Scorch Gorge about? What's that supposed to mean? What? Does that mean something just... Oh, hold on, that's because we're here and it's probably saying, oh, there's something like stunned over here or something, right? I don't know. Hmm. Either way, let's just go back to, uh, Snacksburg. We got- oh wait, uh, uh, yeah, well, back to Snacksburg, but we still have to get the sprinkle peed over in... Whatever it's called. And then while we're over there, we still have to get the big bopsicle. So, we're, we're slowly catching up on all the- getting all the bug snacks, as well as, uh... Shelda's side quest. And then over time, I guess we'll just have to wait and see if... Snorpy's side quest pops up because we it, it, I'm not seeing anything right now and you guys were saying yeah it's Snorpy's the one that has the fourth legendary so I guess just keep an eye on Snorpy maybe it just takes a little while for his side quest to kind of kick in or maybe it only happens after we do the Eggabel thing ooh that may be it actually if that's the case then we might as well while we're here maybe go up to Eggabel and try and do her thing right so let's see what was I doing here oh yeah let's get the Politas Grande and then we can get the uh, Sprinkle Peach so how do we get this guy again we have to wait for the marshmallow guy to come down. I forget what time. Yeah, oh, okay, only at night. So we can go to <laughs> the little... What was it called again? The Kooky? The little Oreo guy? I think so. Is there a bed inside of here that I can sleep? There is. Okay, what time is it right now? Uh, 7 a.m. Oh, jeez, yeah, 7 a.m. But the Sprinkle Pete is probably the perfect time for the Sprinkle Pete. You know, a donut, you know, 7 a.m. What's this thing like again? We can easily catch it with the... Uh, there it is. Chocolate or peanut butter. Okay, let's get the trip shot out. Uh, oops, that's the wrong thing. There you go, trip shot, and then aim at anything that's not the ground. There you go. And throw some peanut butter at it. Oh, whoops. There you go. Alright. And then, uh, try and lure it down. Sprinkle Pete, come on. How do I get that thing to come down? Probably have to get the snag grappler then. There you go. Got him. You fell down. And he hit the trip shot. Nice! Awesome! Sprinkle Pete. Sprinkle Pete. <laughs> I don't know if that was even... Anywhere near close to what it was supposed to sound like. Either way, let's go down here now. Uh, oh wait, no, not down there. Let's go down here, go to sleep until like, I don't know, midnight or something like that. And then hopefully the uh, char mallows will be out. And we could use the char mallows to melt the uh, bops, bopsicles or whatever they're called. And uh, let's see, how do I do this again? Oh yeah, what are these guys like again? Chocolate and peanut butter. So cover the bopsicle guys. In chocolate or peanut butter, so let's do peanut butter because we have a lot of it. Oh, I can't aim like straight down though. There you go, there you go, perfect. Hopefully, it's going to melt them. There you go. 
And then we need to get him before he explodes. So, boom. And, oh! There we go. There we go. We got him. Stunned. Got him. Awesome. We got the big bopsicle. Let's do the Palitas. Because I think we only need one. There you go. Make it getting rid of one little popsicle for two popsicles right there. Popsicle. Bopsicle. All right. Well, I think we, did we get everything here now? In the Sugar Pine Woods? I think we might have, you guys. Let's see. 10 out of 10. We did it, you guys. Awesome. So I think the only thing is, is that Sugar, uh, Frosted Peak, still seven things over there, two of which we don't even know what those are. We have to look at the little clues or whatever and scan them with our, uh, our camera. And then everything else, 10 out of 10 there, 15 out of 15 there, 12 out of 12 there, 14 out of 15 there, but I still don't know how to actually get the cheap, the uh, flaming Hot Cheap Hoof. I'm like, maybe I could lure it to water or something like that, but if I, if I put the buggy ball in water, it washes it off, and then of course with the Lasodi thing, it's gonna spray it too, and that'll wash it off. That seems like a really tricky one, though. And then 12 out of 12 there, 12 out of 13 there, still have to get the caramel thing there, and then 9 out of 9 there, we're really close, you guys to getting every bug snack. This is crazy. Well, let's go back down here. Let's go to Shelda. Go give her the Sprinkle Pea, give her the Palatos and the Flapjack Rack. And then her whole body probably by then is going to be nothing but making bug snacks. Cause she's eaten like what? Three last time. She ate like one. Yeah, she ate one bug snack and then three and then another three right now. And I already gave her like two or three extras on top of that. So Sprinkle Pea, Palatos, where is it? There it is. Flapjack Rack. Boom. I can wake her up right now. Oh wait, is she? Does she say, uh, don't think about bug snacks? Don't think about bug snacks. Don't think about bug snacks. <laughs> she is saying it while she's sleeping. Oh. Oh. Don't think about bug snacks. <laughs> there she goes again. I didn't even know she has eyeballs on her necklace there. That is disgusting. <laughs> Anyways, let's go to sleep now. Oh man, speaking of such, Grandpa, wake up! Get up! 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 Get up! Oh, Sprout! Huh? Oh, just a bad dream. Yeah, you gotta better get up before you eat more bug snacks, because you're already covered in nothing but cheap poof and <laughs> and other stuff right there. But let's turn to the daytime and then uh, we'll return to Shelda. Let's go to let's go to like noon. That should be good. Oh my gosh, the time is flying by so much already over a 30 minute mark, you guys. Holy! Let's go back over here though. Uh, I don't know if we we might have time to. Uh, Try and catch the, like, two other things that's Egg Bell wants. Where is it? Yeah, we have the Stoodler. We need to catch, like, the ice cream sandwich or the chocolate chip cookie. Those should be relatively easy. I think we should have enough time to go up there and try and catch those, and then we could probably end off the episode. Oh, yeah. <laughs> she already has a donut arm. Look at that. A nice day, isn't it? Yeah. Donut arm. And there's Befka. Oh, yeah. Uh, we have Be let's, let's talk to Befka. I forgot we didn't even give her her thing. Uh, oh, let's eat. There you go. Give her the grumpy snack pods. Oh, this is probably going to be disgusting because those are like little gummies or something like that. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, what is that? Oh my gosh. Her body is like a big glob of gummy bears Ugh. or gummy grumpies or whatever. Oh man, that is nasty. Uh, her head. Oh yeah. <laughs> it's just a giant gummy bear on top of her head. Oh my God. That is horrible. What do I do next? A nose or teeth? Nose. Oh, it's just a little one now. Ah, uh, thanks, bestie. If nothing else, I can always rely on bug snacks. <laughs> Isn't it so sad that I call you my bestie? <laughs> I like barely know you. And if I did get to know you, you'd probably hate me for it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, oh well. Yeah. Enjoy it while it lasts, Biffy. Okay, I guess I can't talk to her again and, and do another mission. That's probably the end of that, honestly. Or maybe it wasn't. Probably See ya. Yeah, probably have to wait a little while, but oh my gosh. She looks like legitimately, unironically, not joking, being completely serious here. She looks like the most disgusting. Hello, darling. <laughs> the most disgusting Hello, grump is. She's like a bunch of gummy bears like stuck together like they're left out in the sun and they kind of melted a little bit together. And then she's got a giant one on her head, a, a small one on her nose. And she's got like hot dogs growing out of her too. Oh, it's disgusting. Ugh, it makes me want to like shiver. Ugh, it's nasty. Well, let's talk to uh, Sheldon now who has a, a donut arm, a politas arm. What else? Is that it? We gave her like three things right there. What else turned into like her teeth? Her teeth turned into something? Yeah, she, she, she has like bacon teeth it looks like. Just barely, you can barely see it's like bacon teeth. 
Anyways, let's talk to Shelda. I made more offerings to the box again, but you probably already know that because uh, they're on your body. Don't let the bug snacks bite. Whoops, I accidentally clicked out of that. Whoops, there you go. Thanks, I guess. <laughs> Thanks, I guess. No wisdom to share? No, what's the point? You already know I'm a fraud. I might as well save my energy. Why put on an act? I deserve the truth. Yeah, why put on that act? Well, it's not entirely an act. I really do mean everything I say. It's just... Nobody's gonna listen to Shelsey Woolbag from Nowheresville. But they will listen to Sherda! One who is wise! One who is pure! One who is invincible! I have to set an example for the others. I can't let bug snacks have power over me. I'm supposed to be better than that. Well, you did. Yeah, you ate them anyways. I ate them. Because I'm not better than that. Despite all my years, I'm still weak and clueless. <laughs> if I've got any wisdom left to share, it's how not to end up like me. Oh, another one of these, like, sad ending things where she tries to put on a good example, but no, not even her. She can't even, like, take her own advice and and, and resist the urge for bug snacks. Hey, Philbo. <laughs> I forgot about the mustache I gave him. That's so awesome. I love it. I love his current build right now. Or if you could even call it a build, it's so weird to say that. <laughs> But I love that, you guys. That's crazy. You won't beeswax oh my god, I'm just cutting through, Cromdo. Jeez, settle down. Anyways, I th I'm like, we're at like the 38 minute mark right now. We can we can slip in a little bit more. You, you might call me an addict for saying something like that, but let's go over here to the to the Frosted Peak. Let's go catch like two more bug snacks because we already have the the Stoodler. Uh, we should be able to get the like the like the ice cream sandwich one relatively easy, a little chippy, because the chippy's just like the little little quirky guy that's over here, and the cheeser guy that's over in the desert. So just set down like a, a trip shot, and then just wait for him to come around. Then boom, you got him. So that should be easy. And I forgot what the other ones were that it wanted, but I do know one of them was Stoodler, and we already have that one. So I might as well just go down there and like feed it. Or you know what? You probably have to do it all at once. Actually, now I think about it. So oh, there's Egg Bell again. Now what was everything that we needed? Oh, I probably should go down there and see. But I need to wait for... Well, there's a Scooby Banoopy. I don't know if the Scooby Banoopy was one of them. Let me just go around, though. Where was that Quookie? Or, uh... Was there a... Ma was there one of these guys? I don't remember. Is there anything over here that's frozen that it wanted? I don't think so. The egg roll thing? No. I can't even see what's over there. It's, like, not lower in. Yeah, I can't see anything at all. I guess we'll just go up the mountain see if there's anything over here. Oh, there's the ice. Hold on. What's it say about the ice cream sandwich? Oh, okay. It only appears at night. Okay. So we, we pretty much have to go up anyways if we wanted to go go use uh, Egg Bell's thing to like go to sleep and turn it to nighttime because it's uh, 2 p.m. right now. Probably have to wait a little while for it to turn to nighttime naturally. So, oh, I think it wanted one of these though. Loves peanut butter, loves fire. So, oh, there's the cookie thing. There's the cookie thing. Oh my God. It's like on the side of the thing. Hold on, I thought that was something like... Let me let me scan the kooky. There, there it is right there. Oh, it's going around in circles right there. Hold on, how do I... What is it like? Loves peanut butter. Uh... Can I... Okay, let's do that. Aim. Do a peanut butter on. But why does I keep overshooting like that? Now I undershoot it, and then I overshoot it again! There you go. Let's get our buggy ball out. Cover it in peanut butter, too. There you go. And let's try and stay a nice distance away. Oh, no, he's not getting close enough, though. I need, I need to do, like, one peanut butter, like, right here. And then hopefully that's going to bring him a little bit closer. And then, uh... Hopefully that's going to be good. I, I just want to keep... No, that did What? How do you get this guy, then? Most peanut butter climbs as quick as lightning could be tripped right off the wall. Oh, hold on. Yeah, but it said trip. I, I can't do this, can I? No. And then there... Oh, speaking of peanut butter. There's the flutter jam thing, but it's, like, so high up. Oh, there's another flutter jam up there, too. And the, the peanut butter just kind of despawned right there, too. I don't know if the trip... Can I use the trip shot, like, all the way over here? I don't think so. You might be able to. Let me scan him again so I can see his path. Trip shot. It's not showing his path. There you go. So... Yeah, oh, well, can we do this? Then... Oh, I could do that. Oh, this should... Okay, this should get him. This should get the little, the little cookie guy. Boom! Got him! Nice! Let's get the snack grappler now, because I can't reach that. Got him, got the chippy. Yeah! 
Chippy. Chippy. <laughs> let's go up. And then uh, we have to lure one of the... Oh, hold on. This might be good right here. Hold on. Let's get the trip shot. Uh, aim it at the stump. Cover it in peanut butter. Uh, hold on. And fire. Cover it in peanut butter. Is that good? Oh, man. It doesn't know. Man. It loves peanut... Oh, man. I'm, I'm going to run out of peanut butter here if I'm not careful, you guys. Uh... Is there a way to lure that thing? Huh? I guess we'll just keep going up the mountain over here. There's another stealer. There's more... Creamy patch. Yeah, that's, the, that's still the ice cream sandwich guy. Oh yeah, there's another chippy right there we could've caught. Then from here, I guess we can go up either direction. And it'll take us to, uh... Whatever her name was, his little camp, I suppose. This is going up really... Oh my god, look at that guy climbing around. It's going up really high, you guys. Man! Oh yeah, there. Uh, I forgot there was a, a sleeping bag at the bottom of the mountain as well. I forgot about that too. But there's the uh, the thing. Let's get the trip shot now. Uh, let me retrieve it. I don't know if I'll be able to place this down in time though. There you go. There you go. And boom. And then hit it with peanut butter. Nah, man, it's not working. Ah, uh, that would have been so good though. I don't know how to get the flutter guys. Uh. Well, I guess you know what. Maybe I'll just wait until nighttime then. Then we'll get the, uh, the ice cream sandwich guy. Uh, nighttime, so let's go to midnight. Well, ice cream sandwich guy should be easy. Ah, oh, it should be easy, but maybe it's not. Ah, let's fall off the mountain, Hater! Oh my god! Uh, no fall damage, nice. <laughs> but now we need to get the uh, ice cream sandwich guy. There he is. Uh, I'm thinking maybe just... I, I think, hold on, if I hit him with something, literally anything, is the Lasodi gonna hit him and get rid of his coldness? No, okay, I was- I guess you do have to hit him with fire. Now, where- where- where is this path? Oh, he goes- oh, I- oh, I might be able to hit him with the, uh... Hold on. The- with the- with the campfire thing. Although he's, like, so high up in the air, right? Trip shot. Uh, oh my god, my trip shot's still at the top of the mountain, I forgot about that, jeez. Let's get this, and then place it down, boom. And, uh... See, that's not high enough. I gonna make this, like, go up higher. Or even, like, up to there or something. Like like that. He's going. To, oh, if he circles around there, I think he. I think he'll hit it. Maybe. Ah, uh, hold on. Retract. Aim. Nope. Hold on. Aim. No. Aim there. Retract. Aim. Hit. There you go. Oh no! I got. Oh no! I fell off the mountain. The Scooby Banoopy knocked me off the mountain. Oh 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 oh. Oh no! The Scoop. Oh man. Oh, whoa, 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 there's another campfire over there. Hold on, that one might be a little bit easier. That one might be a little bit easier. Let's let's try that one. Yeah, look at how close. Yeah, look at that. That, like, goes through the trees and stuff, too. Yeah, that one was terrible. And the Scoop... Well, I think the Scoopy Banoopy eventually comes out. Oh, he's about to explode! Uh-oh. Oh, he's gonna blow! He blew! Oh, my gosh! Oh, wait, no, now the... Oh, 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 okay, it's coming around. Okay, I was looking at the, uh... Yeah, look at that. That, that. that cross paths with it perfectly. He's gonna go all the way around, then boom, and then he'll hit that, and then we'll get him. That should melt him and stun him at the same time, and that'll get him. Oh, well, now we get the, the banana Bonopper guy just kind of flying around. That was part of the banana split. <laughs> but uh, let's get our retreat the buggy ball. That should be good. And you know what? Let's get some more peanut butter, because I need some, because I keep running out. I keep spending it over here. I think there's some more peanut butter somewhere else, but just kind of have to wait for the ice cream sandwich guy, and then- Oh, look at that. Growing already. Nice. 8 out of 20. Yeah, I still need way more of that. And then... Got him! Oh, no, he's going to fly and he's going to fall off the map! Oh, got him! Got the chilly nilly. Perfect! Chilly nilly. Chilly nilly. Yeah, he's pretty chill. <laughs> Let's go down here now. I think we have everything. We have the Stoodler. Or, you know, we only need three for the uh, bug statue things. Let me go activate him, and then you probably have to talk to uh, Eggbell afterwards. We can talk to Eggbell next episode, but... Uh, chilly nilly statue. Let's give it this, boom. We have to do it to only just three of them. Is that the chippy? It looks like chocolate chip. Hold on. Oh, whoops. No, that's the Stoodler. Okay, well, we have the Stoodler. Boom. Which one's, uh, Mount so Oh, he could have gotten the Mount Sodi. There's the chippy. Awesome. And what was this one? Scoopy. I think that's just an ice cream cone, not the Scoopy Banoopy. And then Flutter Jam, yeah. So let's do a chippy over here, because we have that one. Boom. All right. Uh-oh. Cutscene? You're okay. You are okay, right? No drowsiness, numbness, or missing limbs? Uh, sorry. <laughs> uh, don't mind me. I, I got the rest of the snacks. That's good. 
Let's go activate the thing then. Okay. Next she says... Oh. She says we need three Grumpuses to do the final step. No. This mountain is unstable. The more of us there are stomping around up here, the more likely it is we'll cause a disaster. I can't let anybody else get hurt for my sake. I feel bad enough involving you. I mean, it's not just for your sake. Yes, yeah, it's, it's to get Lisbur. Well, it's that or go home. Yeah, it's not just for your sake. Think about Lisbur. Oh, what would Lisbur do? Ask Philbo. Liz trusts Philbo for some reason. <laughs> I'll wait for you here. Watch your step on the way back down, okay? <laughs> Alright, you, you should know I li- Oh, jeez, get out of my face. You have an actual egg for a nose. <laughs> I did not notice that. She has an actual egg for a nose. She's shaped like an egg. That's hilarious. Grab that egg. You have an egg- you, What was it called again? An egg- egg something. Ah, I forgot what it was called. There was a joke in there somewhere. She has like an egg bug snacks on her nose. <laughs> on her- she has literal egg on her face. There's the joke. <laughs> I already used that joke earlier. Whatever. Either way, yeah, we have to go ask Philbo for help, so we're going to be doing that next time. So, yeah, I guess I'll just end off the episode right here, because golly, I didn't think it was going to hit, like, the 48-minute mark. So, pff, let's just end it right here. I, I I guess next time we come back, we can go talk to Philbo, and also see if, uh, is, is Snorpy's thing open now? Can I talk to him about it? Uh, where is he on this? No, I still can't talk to him about anything. Wait, what? I meant someone to go home get... Oh, wait, no, hold on. Uh, yeah, see, there's still no Snorpy saves. There's only two of these. Everyone else has three side quests. Snorpy has only two right there, yeah. Well, Triffany only has two as well. She probably has a third thing as well. Wiggle has three. Ramble actually had four. Befka has four. I, I guess we're done with hers then, yeah. And then Wampus had a lot. Well, that was like part of the uh, tutorial phase too, so I guess that makes sense. But either way, let's just head back, grab some uh, more peanut butter while we're at it. So let's go back to Snacksburg, and I guess I'll end off the episode right here. And then next time we come back with some more bug snacks, we need to talk to Philbo. He's going to be a third person to hit the pressure plate because we have me, we have Egg Eggabel, and then of course Philbo is going to be a third one because you need three people to activate all three pressure plates, and that'll open up the door. So that's going to be really good. But like I said, that's going to be for next time. So until then, thank you guys all very much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to let me know by leaving a like down below. And if you guys want more of these awesome videos, be sure to hit that subscribe button and be sure to click that bell. That'll turn on notifications so you don't miss out on an episode because next time we come back, looks like me. Is it possibly the final episode of Bug Snacks where we finally open up the door and find Lizbert like stuck inside the mountain or something crazy? bring her back to Snacksburg and finally leave and, and go publish all of our interviews and findings here on Snack Tooth Island. That'll be pretty fun. Yo. Oh, jeez, Chandlo. <laughs> That'll be pretty fun, but I guess we'll have to wait until next time to find out. But I already did the outro. So until then, thank you guys all very much for watching. And I'll see you guys here next time with some more Bug Snacks. Oh, bye there. Oh.